So I'm going to share with you today an awesome call that I did with a coaching client uh, from Europe who is having a lot of issues with uh, focusing, taking proper actions. And uh, this guy is basically a dabbler. Like he starts a lot of things and doesn't finish anything. Uh, he has five projects at the same time. He speaks big, but you know, doesn't make any money. Nothing ha is happening. And I'm basically in this call, I'm giving him a strategy to just hit his income goals and just move forward aggressively and in a focused way. And I don't know what will happen. I don't know if he'll actually do it or not. Uh, I can only hope. But again, this call has a lot of gems about how to treat your focus, your motivation, how to set uh, the right plan, how to get people to your events, a lot of growth hacks I'm using. Uh, a lot of marketing secrets, so lots of value, highly recommended, just chill out, put the audio on like one and a half times speed or something, and just go through it, I promise you, you're going to be very, very happy with the value you get from it. So with that being said, please enjoy the video, let me know what you think. Basically, what this does is this invites when you click on uh, on an event and you click on invite and then and share and then invite and then invite uh, like all your your friends using this select all button it just takes a bunch of clicks like three clicks and you just click send and it basically sends an invite to all the people you selected so you, in just a few clicks you can uh, send an invite to like 500 people at once. So they get the, the um, they, they basically get the invite to their notifications. You know that when you get like a notification on Facebook that says somebody invited you to so-and-so event? So here's how you actually hack it. Like here's how you actually use this feature and just get a ton of people. So the... When you do this, what happens about, uh, let's say between three to 20 people are going to either sign themselves as uh, going or interested in the event, people who are your friends, because again, you invited them, so it means that you probably think that they should go, and uh, it's just very, very effective. Uh, you, you know about what I'm talking about, right? Okay. Exactly. So yes, you click on suggested and you do select all and you can also pick by the area or if there's an event in the area, you can choose the event, click on all guests and just invite everybody. So click on select all, you can invite about 700 people per account. So in one click, you get 700 invites. It's, it's, uh, it's amazing. It's an amazing tool. But again, here's how you hack it. So if you do it on your own, uh, you know, it's cool. Like you get some people to come, very nice. But, but here's the thing. If you uh, convince other people to invite their friends, then every time you get somebody to invite his friends, you're basically inviting an extra 500 people that are similar to this person because usually people have friends that are similar to them. So now you probably ask are asking, how do you get people to invite their friends? So I'm writing get other people to invite their friends uh, the same way. So you want to get at least, uh, let's say, 15 to 25 people uh, to do that. And if you get 15 to 25 people, and it could be your family, your friends, uh, clients, business partners, people that you just met and just gave them a coaching call and then asked them to do it. If you get 15 to 25 people to do that uh, action, then it's pretty much guaranteed you're going to have, uh, let's do the quick math. So about 20 people invite their friends and about four people, three, four people come per friend. So you're going to get about 50 to 70 people at your lecture just from doing that without anything else. Now, 
Now, here's here's how you here's how you actually uh, get people to to do it. So obviously, you can't just come up to anybody and just say, "Hey, please do that." Like you can do it with friends and family and business partners, but you can't just come up to people that are not that good friends. And you know, maybe you don't have. 20 people that would just do that, you know, just because he asked it, them. So, so you get people to, uh, I'm saying you, I'm writing down, you get people to do that by giving them massive value. So I don't care if you have to clean their lawn, uh, give them coaching for free, uh, you know, give them compliments, fuck them, whatever you need to do. Just give them a lot of value where there's a, a balance. There's no longer a balance where you gave them a lot of value and they feel like they want to give it back. So uh, you could call people and just ask how they're doing and how are they doing with their goals and with you know stuff that you can help them with and just give them help. Just help them. Give them value. And then at the end, just say, there's one thing you can do that would really help me. It would really help if you go to the event and you basically invite uh, your friends. And from my experience, people don't have a problem to do that because you're not actually inviting them personally. You're just clicking on a button and it invites them for you. So people don't really don't resist. Uh, they don't have a problem doing it. And if you get 15 to 25 people to do it, you're going to have a big lecture with uh, at least 50 people. So you wanted a clear strategy. Uh, you got the strategy. That's the clear strategy. So you get about, so let's run some numbers. Okay, so uh, breaking down the numbers. Uh, okay, so you get 70 people in the lecture. In the lecture. Uh, just to give, even let's go back a bit, uh, you're going to get about, I would say, 50 people uh, uh, sign the event as uh, going, and you're going to get about, um, I would say, 140 people uh, sign on the event as interested. So that's just the statistics that I found. You get about, usually for these kinds of events, it's about one to three. So for each person uh, that's going, there's about three people that are interested. And if you uh, basically put them together, usually divided by three, that's about how many people you're going to get. So if you have 50 interested and 140, uh, 50 going and 140 interested, you're going to get about uh, a third of, of the sum. So that's about 70 people in the lecture. So uh, I'm writing down, so that's about uh, going plus interested uh, divided by three. Okay, so you want to do the math for these things because uh, then you know how to predict things. Now, let's say 70 people show up. At the end of the lecture, you give a simple uh, offer. You say you you're, uh, print out a page and people like a big uh, table and you print out like five pages and you give them to people across the lecture, like one in this area, one in this area, so that nobody, you know, leaves before uh, they get a page to sign their name. And basically it says, uh, please put your name, your phone, your email. And, uh, you know, if you're interested in me contacting you to do a, a free uh, consultation meeting. Okay, so that's actually uh, how to get um, strategy. So how to get consultation meetings. I'm writing down. Uh, so uh, again, one uh, print a table with uh, name, uh, phone, and uh, email. And email. Okay, and then so about. Uh, so let's say about five pages of a table, okay? And then um, hand them out and let people who are interested in a free consultation meeting uh, 
in a free consultation meeting, uh, book, you know, uh, get a call from you. Okay, so about uh, out of 70 people that are going, if you give a really, really, really good lecture plus a really, really good um, pitch at the end, so you kind of sell it well and you're confident and you know you know how to talk to people, uh, you're gonna get about a third, I would say, about 30%. So you should get about 23 uh, interested, 23 um, free consultation meetings so, so 23 people uh, interested in uh, free consultation meetings. And if you do a bad job, uh, you would get about 10%, which is about, uh, let's say, five people. So between five to 20 people. Now, out of those, I would say about 70% are going to show up. So we're going to about three to 16 people actually... Uh, show up to the meeting and out of those uh, you should close about uh, between a third to half so about 40 percent so that means you should, you should close anywhere between one person to uh, five people actually uh, sold on the coaching package so so one to five people let's do an average so two and a half times 500 euro, uh, euros but let's say you don't do 500 let's say you do a bit less so you should get about a thousand euros uh, so two times um, 500 euros two and a half sorry times 100 euros uh, is about, um, times 500, is about 2,550 uh, euros. Um, modest, a modest um, projection. So it could be a lot more. i um, saying if you get around 70 people and you do a really not a very good job, but you know you get some people to book with you. You should get at least a thousand euros from selling. If you do a really good job, uh, you could close even five people, and that would be uh, about twenty five hundred euros, maybe more. So, uh, does 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 the whole strategy make sense to you? Do you have any questions? Sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So so the thing is, uh, with all due respect, you you just barely were able to pay me the two hundred uh, dollars uh, for this. Um, I mean, you're not really in a place where you can start, you know, playing with money. So I'm, I'm all for paid ads, by the way. I just recorded a video yesterday about how important it, it is to spend money, that it's better to spend, like lose money on advertising than to not advertise at all. Uh, but in your specific position, I just gave you a pretty straightforward method to guaranteed uh, get at least 50 people in your lecture without paying anything, just using energy. Now, once you get that done and you actually break your goal, then you know you can go ahead, pay some people back, and then start you know promoting with ads. But right now, where you are. 
you know, if it took you like a month and a half just to get the $200 to pay me, uh, then if you just start thinking about ads, you're going to, you're not going to think right. You're going to think very limited, very, you know, you can't afford to make mistakes. The only time you want to spend money on ads is when you're willing to lose some money and you're not really there. So I need you to focus because, again, you're a very smart, you're a very creative person, uh, but you tend to get lost. You tend to, you know, go all in at all places. But I promise you, if you hit the targets I gave you, if you actually invite 15 to get 20, 15 to 25 people to invite their friends you're good. You're going to get a minimum of 50 people coming and you're going to start closing some sales and getting known and people will contact you and you're going to do coaching calls and you're going to get, again, finally sales, finally money. Um, if you deviate from the plan, I, I can't help you. Like if you come, if you just decide, oh, that sounds good, but I'm going to do something else, then I, I don't know what you're going to get. But if you actually do what I just told you, I know what's going to happen because I've done it and I helped other people do it. Uh, do you have any other questions? Anything on your mind? Mm hmm Yeah, but that's that's not a question. No, I'm saying, is there a question? You can teach whatever the fuck you want. It, it doesn't matter. Like, but obviously, if you're gonna do online business, uh, first of all, you're not gonna feel good because you don't have uh, a lot of wins in uh, that area at the moment. And secondly, it's uh, pretty niche, like not, you know, there's, I don't, I don't think there's that many people, uh, in your area, but if you focus on like something like goals, you know, it's very broad. So there's a lot of people that could be interested in that. So you, you need to focus. So you can do anything you want uh, in addition to this strategy, but not instead of. So if you want to upload a video every day and whatever, post, uh, message people, I don't know, whatever you want to do, you know, do it. Even do the Facebook ads. It's not the point. The point is do, do the strategy. Anything else is a bonus. Now the strategy is... Uh, it's uh, it's uh, very straightforward, but it's not easy. So you need to get about two and a half people every day to invite all their friends. And you know that it's not that hard. Like it's really not hard, but it does take some commitment. So if you follow this uh, plan, uh, this is the result that you're going to get. I'm just, again, straight up, maybe... You know, at the high end, maybe at the low end, but you're going to make money. You're going to do, you know, get people to come. You're going to do the strategy sessions. It's, you're going to start seeing results. And uh, you have this thing where you, you're you like, maybe I'll try this. Maybe I'll try that. Maybe I'll try this now. Maybe I'll try that now. But um, I'm telling you, if you do this, you're going to get results. It's not about trying. It's about if you actually get the hit this, these numbers you're going to see results period so are you committed to doing this is, is there anything you you see that might stop you from Um, if you think it's going to take you a bit more than two weeks to make it happen, to get 15 to 25 people, then do three weeks. Uh, 
Um, yeah, so obviously, I mean, do you know anybody from Madrid? Okay, so so you can already start marketing just from uh, from afar, right? You can already talk to people in Madrid and ask them to invite their friends. So just do it for three weeks from now, and uh, and start promoting it today. You know, open the event today, uh, design it. You know, write the copy, do a video about it and uh, start promoting it. Again, when I say promoting, I mean very specifically getting people to invite their friends. That's the strategy we're going with that will guarantee, is guaranteed to get you a lot of people coming if you actually get the, the right number of people to do that. Mm -hmm. So, uh, the reason I don't focus on other things like, uh, again, practicing for the event is because you have a tendency to get very distracted. And, uh, and so I'm trying to really keep it to the minimum, just the things you have to do. And again, you want to practice, practice. You want to do Facebook ads, do that. You want to do YouTube videos, do that. But as long as you hit the goals. So if you do the things in the strategy and then you have some time left to practice, then do that. It's just, I don't care if you bomb. Like, I don't care if you get 50 people and it fucking sucks. Like, it's horrible. That is better than you focus on practicing and then not getting any people because you focus too much on practicing. You want to do you want to do a different thing instead of promoting yourself promote uh, your partner Alejandro and uh, tell him that he'll uh, let's say he'll pay you 10 uh, let's say 15 euros for every person that comes Yeah. So again, I get it. You're scared. It's not easy. It's out of your comfort zone. But remember that, you know, your first email to me, the first thing you 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 wrote to me when uh, you first contacted me, you said, um, I'm all in. I'm a massive action. I'm super focused. Uh, and I I've, I've really haven't seen any of that, to be honest. I've seen lots of uh, starting things, but you don't really finish anything. Uh, it's not massive action if you don't finish things. It's only massive action if you actually go follow through and finish things. When you just start a lot of things, it's not massive action. It's called dabbling. It's just doing, it doesn't give you anything. And you can see the results in your life. The thing is, you are not in a good place. You don't have any money. And it's one thing to not have money, but you know, be going somewhere. You don't have any money. And you're not going anywhere. Like there's no, there's no upward uh, statistics. It's not like you're getting more appointments every day, more money, more sales calls. You just don't get anything. You're just stuck at zero, and you keep moving a bit up, and then you go back to zero. And every time I'm trying to coach you, I'm like, do this and this and this, and you're like, yeah, but have this idea and this idea and this idea and this idea. And then I say, no, no, let's just focus one thing. And even the one thing I ask you to do, you don't do it. And then I talk to you a few weeks later. I'm like, how are you doing? You're like, oh, I've started this thing and this thing and this thing and this thing. And nothing gives you money. Like nothing make, gives you results. Like eventually you're just going to give up. You're just going to say, I don't know why I'm starting anything because I'm just not, you know, I'm not getting anything done. So maybe just, you know, fuck it. Like I just won't start anything anymore at all. And, uh, you know, you're on that path. Like if you don't start committing to one specific plan and uh, let's say this month, this is your plan and you don't do anything else. 
if you don't focus on just this plan and you start trying other things and your uh, brilliant ideas and, and other, you know, projects, uh, we're just going to talk again uh, a few weeks from now and uh, you would still not move. And again, I'm, I'm barely asking you for any money to do this. I genuinely want to see you grow. And I'm giving you this because I, I, I genuinely want to see you grow. And, um, but if every time we talk, you don't actually do what I tell you, then, you know, it's kind of pointless. So if this plan is good with you and you say, okay, I, I get the plan, I'm going to stick to it. I'm going to make it happen again. I don't care what you do in your spare time, but if you get, if you do this, you're going to see results and it's going to be scary and it's not going to be easy and it's not going to feel natural because your brain is used to doing things the wrong way. So it's not going to feel natural, and that's a good thing. The fact that it doesn't feel natural, it means it's the right thing because your brain is used to doing the wrong thing. So just follow my lead and uh, make this happen. And again, if you have any questions, and I really have to wrap this up, but if you have any questions, let me know. If you have any hesitations, let me know so that so that I know that when we finish this call, you're gonna, you know, pull through and make this happen. Um, I'm not sure, I'm not sure in Europe. I would ask uh, Alejandro or somebody that did, does a lot of uh, events, that they know when the best time is. Roughly, the, yeah, it could be a few days more, a few days less. So if you have any challenges, any problems, you're stuck with something, then uh, let me know. Message me, email me, just say, hey, I'm trying to do this. It's not working. Don't tell me if you're not doing anything. Just tell me if you tried to do something and it's not working because I can help you fix it. Maybe about your, your uh, persuasion, maybe the way you approach something. I can give you tips, but, but I can't help you if you're not doing anything. So... Commit to it, you know, do what you need to get committed. Like if it's maybe, you know, you tell your friend you have to do this many calls or, you know, you pay him money or whatever. Just find a way to, you know, make sure you actually get this done. And uh, and that's it, really. Just, just follow through on the plan. Just execute. It really, again, sit down with yourself and ask yourself, do you want to keep living like this? Do you want to keep being stuck? and um you know not moving anywhere or do you want to start you know moving forward so uh you're gonna have to start breaking your comfort zone and uh i know you don't like that but you are gonna have to start committing to just one idea uh and putting your imagination on hold for a few days and just get this done. And uh, once you open the event, um, so I'm writing down accountability. So uh, one, um, let's see. So I'm writing down one, uh, open, send me uh, a link to the event once you've created it. Uh, by the way, you can also send emails to people. There's many ways, but but again, just get people to invite their friends. This is really important. Um, so send me a link to the event once you create it, and then uh, every few days, give me an update about how many people are going and interested. interested um let me know about any challenges you're having okay do you have any other questions and yeah, this really i gotta wrap up because uh
Yeah, yes, exactly. Your brain is not working properly right now. And why can I say this? Because there's a lot of things you're trying to do and your brain is not making it happen. So you can't trust your brain. You need to do the things that are not intuitive right now. Um, so yeah, there's no, you should do less thinking. Like the more thinking you do, the worse it gets. Like the more you think about it and uh, try to rationalize it and try to make sense of it, you're just going to shoot yourself in the leg. Just don't think about it. Just do it. You have an action steps. You have, you see, you have everything broken down. Like one, create the Facebook events Two, design it. Three, write the copy Four, upload a video. Five, click share, invite your friends. Six, get 15 to 25 people to invite their friends. That's it. That, that's literally the plan. <laughs> If you follow this plan, you're going to get results, period. Mm -hmm. uh, so I just, I just sent you everything. Just broken down. Everything you need is here. Yeah, because at the beginning, you don't need the text because nobody will actually know about your event. So just, uh, yeah, exactly. Just, uh, yeah, put something in and then design the copy. Uh, by tomorrow, you should already have uh, the event up. You should have it designed. You should have the copy. You should do a video about it. And then by tomorrow, you should start, you should finish with all of that, uh, invite all your friends, and then start inviting, asking other people to invite their friends. Um, the what? Um, put a video, no, put just a regular post, just, you know, just put a picture, a cover, but, but just, uh, Upload a video to the lecture page, to the event page, and then just uh, so people can look at it. And, you know, some people like to read, some people like to listen to, to see a video. Okay. Awesome, dude. So let me know if you have any other questions, okay? But, uh, but again, just please start working, start making it happen. And uh, again, you do that, you're gonna get the results, you're gonna start seeing good things happen. You, you don't do that, you're not, you're not gonna move. The, the main thing you want to do right now is probably tell people that are, that really care about you. And uh, I'm not saying like your mom, like people like, you know, friends or uh, partners that this is what you're committed to doing and that, you know, if they see that you're not doing that, then you need them to help you, you know, push forward. So, so start talking, you know, start moving towards that. Uh, again, I know it's not going to be easy. Um, you know, I wish I could help more, but right now this is what you got. Like you got a plan, you know, get it done. And if, you don't get it done if you, um, you know, if you, we, we talk a few weeks from now and you haven't actually done it, then it's a very good sign for you that you're in a really dangerous spot because basically you can't trust yourself to do the things you're committed to doing. Like your brain is actually controlling you. So this is actually a test to see how much uh, willpower you have, how much you can focus. Again, don't think, just just do it. Just take action now. Uh, don't, you know, just don't stop. Just move, 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 take actions. Uh, the less you think about it, the better. Okay? Awesome, dude, so keep me updated, okay? You too, dude. You too. Uh, I'm really looking forward to hearing from you. Awesome. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Uh, so if you haven't noticed, uh, this was a really good call uh, with a guy that's having a lot of problems. And I hope you took 
a lot of value from it. See you soon.